So, as you can see, I have Melania, 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 um, Melania. We'll just say Melania. And it honestly, thankfully, it didn't take me that long. It only took me, I think, two multis to get her. And using her, I think she's very strong. Um, the thing is, is that you want... So I need to level up this by quite a margin. And it it's just like you need to ascend and get your psy cubes up by quite a bit. So we'll just upgrade that by a bit. And then look at her stats here. Obviously, um, 1186 for the attack and 6694 for HP, which is very strong. Her defense is pretty high at reality defense being 596. Mental defense being 591. Um, at the moment, uh, I just have like a farming team. It's not really like focused on high difficulty content. And that would be Centurion. Millennia and regular so like you got aoe right there and just a lot of damage but in terms of where i would put her and like the top units in the game i would say millennia is probably top four maybe top three i would say centurion is still the best unit in the game i would say after her is probably eternity for her self-sustainability being even just like a solo unit and i can see millennia or possibly regulus being right there but you know let's go ahead and just take millennia into um, some pieces of content just to really see what she is capable of doing so as you can see here we have her in the um the plant book um insight quest so obviously she's going to be strong here but we can see her where she stacks up to units such as centurion and obviously we have dyke here to provide us with the healing so we can go ahead and use centurion's aoe and then we'll use millennia's aoe and then her single target just to see what she's capable of doing so centurion here does a total of about 3300 and millennia does the a little bit under at 2000 but you have to remember with her two target attack she is providing healing for herself so you pair that up with another healer and another dps and quite frankly you are going to be looking real good because of the fact that you're providing that sustainability for her so she stays alive by herself and you have another healer to provide even more healing um so it, it's just how it is granted you know it's kind of not of a fair comparison to be stacking her up to centurion because i do think centurion is like unquestioned like i said number one because of how much damage she is capable of doing so we'll go ahead and just do some of this stuff not a whole lot but her single target there doing 2660 which is super strong and then here coming on to the final stage we have both ultimates so we have millennia's here which is a single target and provides the thief master on the caster which is something that she really really needs so we'll go ahead and pop that we'll use the centurion aoe and then we can go ahead and use centurion single target um granted we want to see millennia's ultimate here because a great animations um, and you can see 7,000 damage on one unit and, you know, she does have the type advantage, but you know, this unit is very beefy and strong. We got the days and doing all that. So we have the, the debuffs on here. So now we can use the dual target. We use the dual target there and then Dyke's ultimate to really just do more damage. So increases the leech rate gives us one moxie and as you can see did a ton of damage go ahead and just rewrite that but that's just a example on millennia's abilities do i think she's the best unit in the game no do i think she is like a top five unit yes right now she is um she provides a lot 
She's not the highest damage dealer, but you know that could change with depending on how you build her on her Renaissance. But she is definitely a unit. If you don't have Centurion or Eternity, um, you have a higher chance to get her Millennia right now because of her banner. So the increased rate to get her compared to trying to get a Centurion or Eternity on these other two banners or even this banner. So I do think she is worth it. Um, I think you probably should just do a couple multis. Not a whole lot because we do have, I think, better units coming out. But for the time being and for what she is... I do think she's a very good and capable unit.